So the controlled area lab is the lab responsible for both analyzing fuels and compressed gases. And more specifically, why we test the fuels here is to ensure that before refueling any aircrafts or ground transportation vehicles, that there's no impurities in them. Um, on the compressed gas side of things, it's very similar. We test them as a quality assurance, quality control, just to ensure that there's no impurities for the aviators breathing that, as well as the firefighters and maintenance folks. The process for receiving samples to test is twofold. Either we're receiving the samples here locally by drop off of fuels or compressed gases, or surrounding bases are dropping off their fuels and gases to be tested. The fuels aspect is shutting down completely. All of the samples that were tested here, as far as fuels are concerned, are now being redirected to one of our sister labs at Wright Patterson Air Force Base in Ohio. As far as the compressed gas lab, about 80% of the compressed gas samples are being redirected to either our sister lab in Mildenhall, UK, or Wright-Patterson Air Force Base, Ohio. The small remaining portion of compressed gases that stays behind will be tested by the POL lab folks. So the lab here is shutting down for three main reasons. For one, it's really difficult to maintain the equipment out here. Uh, for two, it's really difficult to get samples here in a timely manner due to the international customs and courtesies and three, and we've easily been able to prove that we can redirect the samples to Wright-Patterson and they can handle that increased workload.